Well, hello, my friends. Frankie Oswag here along with Martin McFly Winter, and we just wrapped up Stage 2 of the 2014 Swatch Free Ride World Tour by the North Face right here in Chamonix, Mont Blanc, France. And a great day of competition, McFly. Let's break it down. We'll talk through the highlights here. Yeah, we're at the second stop in Chamonix just after Courmayeur. What a great day we had. Absolutely. The birthplace of all things extreme, sometimes referred to as the death sport capital of the world. Same venue as last year, the Agui Poirie. Conditions a little trickier, not as much snowfall, but the competitors, the riders, made the best of it. Of course, starting with the first category of the day, snowboard men, and getting sixth place from Austria, Flo Orly, putting one down here on the Agui Poirie. And Sammy Lubke, the American, up to his usual antics, another top five finish for him. Of course, with the big win in Courmayeur, Lubke on a roll here in 2014, getting fourth place. It's the Frenchman, very consistent riding here so far, Ludovic Guillot Diaz. And getting third place on the podium from right here in Chamonix, another French rider, Christophe Charlet, throwing it down, very aggressive approach right out of the gate. And on this particular instance right there, narrowly missing the rock, able to take it to his feet. A good all-around performance for Charlet. Judges certainly had their work cut out for him. And in second place, so solid this year, off to quite a fabulous start. The Canadian Jamie Rizzuto putting one together here. Nice fall line riding, very confident in his lines, charging hard with confidence. And of course your champion, excuse me, your winner, Swiss rider Emilian Badu. Really strong performance of Emilian today with his uh, really nice feature in the middle. This triple section right there. Oh yeah. Stomped perfectly. Really impressed the judges with his high speed performance today. And not the best day for your defending champion from the USA, Ralph Backstrom, having problems right away out of the gate. Really changing snow conditions today. A lot of wind overnight, unfortunately, made it really difficult for them to be consistent. Yeah, so a bit of a change in the standings here in Chamonix. And we move on to the next category of snowboard women. And there's Frances Margot Raziez riding really hard and riding her way into fourth place. But very athletic with a lot of energy. And in third place, Estelle Ballet, the young Swiss rider, making her way on the Swatch Free Ride World Tour for 2014. Very solid, very consistent. The rookie on the tour really did a good job today, and we're going to see definitely some more over the season to come. Absolutely. The future is bright for that young Swiss rider right there, giving us the thumbs up. And taking second place, making her debut as well on the Swatch Free Ride World Tour in 2014, the Australian Amber Schuker. And she just rode really smart, very solid, believed in herself, and rode with confidence, and taking top honors today, the American Shannon Yates, a very solid delivery and a veteran competitor on the Free Ride World Tour. Yeah, as you said, very experienced rider Shannon Yates. She went where the good snow was, performed exactly what the judges wanted to see, and came in first. Absolutely, getting the job done. So congratulations once again. Going out to Amelia Badu, going out to Shannon Yates.